Welcome to another video by LSX Engines Tuning Marine. In this video, I'm going to winterize a 5.7 liter V8 in a fairly decent sized boat. It had a fuel injection, but somebody took that off and put a carburetor on it. So the you know, customer wants me to just, uh, he said it doesn't run right, so he wants me to check it all out. So uh, anyway, this thing's got to be winterized. Um, I've already pulled the plugs out of the uh, back of the back of this exhaust, exhaust manifold and back of that exhaust manifold but the plug there's two plugs in the bottom of the block that stripped out I can't get them out in there they've been in there for a long time and so the uh, the heads of those plugs uh, they're quarter inch in, uh, national pipe thread metal plugs but the head was 9 16 and just stripped off even with a six point socket so at this time I'm trying to winterize it by getting the water out so what I just did was there was a temperature sensor the sensor right here temperature sensor was in this uh in this uh thermostat outlet right here i pulled that out and then i pulled the uh top radiator hose or top cooling hose off here this is the one that goes back down to the water pump on the engine pull that off so what i'm about to do and then I, what i did was took uh compressed air my compressed air tank uh, i don't have power down here so i pre-charged the tank before i got here and i just kind of covered this hole in my hand like so best I could and, and, fit and put compressed air on it and you can see the uh, compressed air blew the water out of the engine. The water was coming out here and it was coming out there because I, I put power, you know, put um, air through the water pump which then fed into the block and that pushed all the water out of the top of the block. So now that I've done that, what I'm about to do is pour pink RV antifreeze down this hole. You don't run with it but it's something you can winterize with pour it down this hole until it comes out these holes and then I know I've got the engine filled up with antifreeze. So that's what I'm about to do. Okay, so what I've done is uh, I poured a gallon of this uh, Prime Guard RV Marine, it's pink, and I poured it down in this, uh, the, this hose here. And what it did was uh, normal colored water was displaced and came out here and here. So I haven't seen any pink yet. So I bought two gallons of this. I'm fixed to pour the second gallon in. And I'm going to keep pouring until I see pink antifreeze coming out here or here, either one. But uh, right now, the antifreeze, all it's done is uh, just dis displace the water. Um, it'd probably be okay if I left it like it is, but I don't know what the uh, concentration of the antifreeze would be mixed with the water in there. So I'm going to keep pouring until I see pink come out the top. Then I know it's got enough antifreeze in it. All right, so far I've poured uh, not quite two gallons of this antifreeze. This type of antifreeze in this engine, uh, poured it in this hose, and it finally, what it did was uh, fresh water or raw water came out this hole and that hole. It was clear, but eventually it turned pink. So I know that the, the antifreeze displaced the water in the engine, and it came out pink. So now I know the engine's fully uh, full of the pink antifreeze. In hindsight, uh, I didn't need the compressed air. Um, what I could have done is just pour the antifreeze in this hole, and the antifreeze would have displaced the water, pushed it out. Didn't need, the, didn't need the compressed air to do that at all. So if you have to winterize your boat, you can't get your lower block drain plugs out, this is how you do it. Pour an antifreeze in this hole, watch for the antifreeze come out the top, and you've displaced all the water with the antifreeze. Not that hard to do. But you do have to drain your, your exhaust manifolds because this method, the antifreeze comes out here and doesn't get forced down through your exhaust. So you've got to drain the exhaust. And, uh, I know those are drained because I pull these two plugs out of the back of the exhaust manifolds. So that's how you winterize a block or an engine or the block that you can't get the drain plugs out of. Thanks for watching.